Closet. Natasha Courtney joins me. <laughs> And I love that we're talking about fashion. There are so many people in the creative industry that do rock uh, all black, everything, all the time. So it is definitely possible. It's doable. And it might be actually even easier for you. Well, I think it is because I don't have to think about what I'm going to wear in the same way as someone does that has to match up color, right? Yes, so yes. I don't think I would do a very good job of it. So this makes <laughs> my life much easier. So you've got three different looks here, and these are looks that you might wear to, you know, various occasions. Black isn't always just for elegant and dressed up. You can use it for casual, and I'm talking about summer, fall, winter, totally. and spring. Uh, you can always rock it. So I am loving isn't it great? this yeah. whole athleisure trend, and that's what you're rocking here with these joggers. I love this look, and this entire look is under $100. Ooh, nice. This top, I mean, it's mixing two of my favorite trends because you have the jogger, but you also have the cutout trend. Yes. And I love it because it, it comes, it's cut out in the perfect spot. Yes. Because we have, like, we have nice shoulders. Yes, yeah, And them so off. we want to be able to show them off. So uh, this is one of my favorite looks. And the fabric is nice and light, so perfect for the summer. And okay. you can rock it with sneakers and, um, one of my favorite looks for sure. So that's one thing to think about because some people might say, I don't want to do black in summer because it's just too heavy. Go with lighter fabrics. A hundred percent. Yeah. And also fabrics that can breathe. Like I feel like with something like this, this fabric re breathes, but also it's instant air conditioning when there's a cutout. <laughs> that's right. Right? Just do this and you're good. <laughs> it's right? true. It's true. Okay, let's move over here to the jumpsuit. I have not met a jumpsuit I do not love. Me too. They're love so them. comfortable. And you don't have to worry about them. You don't have to worry about pairing two pieces. Yes. This is one of my favorites from Helmet Lang. Mm -hmm. And um, I got this at the Bay. Again, under $200. Excellent. Excellent, right? Yes. And you can actually wear it during the day, which is awesome. But put on a pair of heels, and you can wear it at night. And leather, you can wear leather all year round. I do. Yes. And I just think, put on a leather jacket in the evening, and it gives it a little bit of edge as well. And it the detail does. on the side here, I just think is so pretty. So lightweight fabrics, once again, um, this is, I would say, totally Natasha Koithman. <laughs> you are always in a really cool moto, and I like that you will do an elegant dress with a moto, or you will do a casual look with a moto yeah. jacket. It is always in style. Always. I will pair this leather jacket, actually, with a gown. Yes. Just because I feel like it gives it a bit of edge. Yeah. What's nice about this is it just undoes, and so it becomes a little bit shorter. Oh, that's cool. And Zara has the exact same jacket right now, for under a hundred dollars. Ooh, I thank you for shopping yeah. for us. I like this. She scoped out all the deals. Okay, finally a cutout dress. So I'm loving cutouts. Me too. Um, there's something very good about the cutout here. It's perfect because this is like our slimmest Small. area, right? Like we're thin here. Our yeah. ankles are thin. We're a little bit thinner here. Yeah. And this cuts in just the perfect spot. And I love this also because you could put a leather jacket over top of it and wear it for during the day. I've done mm -hmm. that to the office. But then you put on a pair of heels, you take off the leather jacket, you maybe put a necklace on, and you're good to go for the evening. Right. And it's just so feminine and pretty. It absolutely is. Uh, and it just goes to show you, all black can work for you. It can make your life so much easier, too. It's my when favorite. Did, when did you sort of convert to the whole all black everything? I'd say about 20 years ago. About 20 yeah, years ago. Yeah, because it just made it easy for me. Yeah. I would buy color, and it would just sit in my closet with the tags on. <laughs> right. And then I realized, you know what? Like, I just feel best in black, and yeah. I just didn't fight it. And I think it's important to listen to that. Yeah, well, you know, once you go black, you can't go back. <laughs> <laughs> True that. You know.